Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. If you're running a Shopify store and you're not using Klaviyo, you're potentially leaving thousands of dollars on the table. Seriously. In today's video, we're diving deep into how to use Klaviyo with Shopify for email marketing automation in 2025. I'm going to walk you through everything, step by step, from the initial setup to advanced strategies that will turn your email list into your most profitable asset. So, grab a coffee, and let's get started. First things first, why Klaviyo? While Shopify has its own email tool, Klaviyo is a powerhouse. It offers incredibly deep integration with Shopify, allowing you to track customer behavior eventos like viewed product, added to cart, and started checkout with pinpoint accuracy. This data is gold. It lets you create hyper-personalized and automated email campaigns that feel like they're written just for one person, which is exactly what drives conversions. Let's get it set up. Head over to the Shopify App Store, search for Klaviyo, and install the app. The setup wizard is super intuitive. It will ask you to connect your Shopify store, and with just a few clicks, Klaviyo will start pulling in all your historical customer and order data. This is crucial because it means you can start creating powerful segments right away, even before you've sent a single email. Don't skip any steps here. Make sure the integration is fully synced. Once you're in the Klaviyo dashboard, it can feel a bit overwhelming, but let's break it down. The key areas you'll live in are campaigns, flows, lists and segments, and analytics. Campaigns are your one-off emails, like for a Black Friday sale, or a new product launch. Flows are the real magic. These are your automated email sequences. Think welcome series, abandoned cart reminders, and post-purchase follow-ups. Before we build Qualcare Coisa, we need to capture emails. The default Shopify pop-up is okay, but Klaviyo's sign-up forms are far more powerful. In Klaviyo, go to sign-up forms. You can create pop-ups, fly-outs, or embedded forms. I recommend starting with a simple pop-up offering a 10% discount for new subscribers. Use Klaviyo's A-B testing feature to test different headlines, images, and offers to see what converts best. Make it visually appealing and ensure it's mobile-friendly. Now for the fun part, setting up your first essential flows. Let's start with the welcome series. This is the first impression you make, so make it count. Go to flows, Click Create Flow, and you'll see a library of templates. Choose the Welcome Series template. A great welcome series is typically three to five emails long. The first email should deliver the discount code you promised and introduce your brand story. The second can highlight your best-selling products. The third could share customer testimonials or user-generated content to build social proof. The goal is to build a relationship, not just push for a sale immediately. Next up, the abandoned cart flow. This is your money maker. According to studies, nearly 70% of online shopping carts are abandoned. Clavio's abandoned cart flow can help you recover a significant portion of that lost revenue. Again, use the pre-built template. The first email should go out about one to four hours after the cart is abandoned. It's a gentle reminder, maybe with an image of the item they left behind. The second email, sent 24 hours later, can create a sense of urgency like, your items are selling fast. For the third email, consider offering a small incentive like free shipping or a small discount to nudge them over the finish line. But we can go deeper than a standard abandoned cart. Let's talk about the browse abandonment flow. This targets people who viewed a product but didn't even add it to their cart. Clavio's Shopify integration tracks this. You can set up a flow that triggers a few hours after someone views a product, sending them an email saying, hey, were you checking this out? It's less aggressive than an abandoned cart email, but incredibly effective at keeping your brand top of mind. Now, let's talk about segmentation. This is what separates the beginners from the pros. Sending the same email to your entire list is a recipe for high unsubscribe rates. In Klaviyo, go to Lists and Segments. You can create dynamic segments based on almost any criteria. For example, create a VIP customer's segment for people who have spent over a certain amount, say $500. 
You can send them exclusive offers, early access to new products, and special thank you notes. Another powerful segment is potential purchasers. You can define this as people who have opened or clicked an email in the last 30 days, but have not made a purchase. This is a warm audience. You can target them with a specific campaign, highlighting your value proposition or a limited time offer. You can also create a win back campaign segment for customers who haven't purchased in, say, 90 or 180 days. Send them an email with a compelling offer to bring them back. Something like, we miss you. Here's 15% off to come back. Let's not forget post-purchase flows. Your relationship with a customer doesn't end at checkout. A post-purchase flow is perfect for building loyalty. The first email should be a thank you and order confirmation. A week or two later, you can ask for a review. If they bought a consumable product, you can set up a replenishment reminder flow that triggers when they're likely running low. You can also use this flow to cross-sell related products. Did they buy a shampoo? A few days later, send an email suggesting the matching conditioner. This is all automated, working for you 24-7. As we look towards 2025, personalization is everything. Use Clavio's dynamic template tags to personalize your emails. Don't just use their first name. You can dynamically insert the products they viewed or purchased directly into the email body. For instance, hey, first name, still thinking about the product name? This level of personalization shows you're paying attention and significantly boosts click-through rates. Finally, always be testing. Never assume you know what works best. In Clavio, you can A-B test almost anything. Subject lines, email content, sending times, and even entire flow paths. For subject lines, try a question versus a statement. For email content, test a lifestyle image versus a simple product shot. Let the data guide your decisions. Check your analytics dashboard regularly. Pay attention to open rates, click-through rates, and most importantly, the conversion rate and revenue generated by each email and flow. To recap, the keys to mastering Clavio for Shopify are nail the integration, build high converting signup forms, implement the essential flows, welcome abandoned cart and post purchase, and then layer on advanced strategies with deep segmentation and personalization. And always, always be testing. It might seem like a lot, but by taking it one step at a time, you can build a powerful email marketing machine that drives growth and builds lasting customer relationships. This is how seven and eight figure brands use email, and there's no reason you can't do the same. I hope this detailed guide was super helpful for you. If you got value from this video, please hit that like button. It really helps the channel out. And for more e-commerce and marketing tutorials, Make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss a thing. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments below. I'll do my best to answer every single one. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.